Have you been successful in your career, but when it comes to relationships, you feel like a failure? If so, you're going to want to listen in. This has nothing to do with intelligence and everything to do with skill set. Over the past 10 years, I've been helping women create healthy relationships. And one of the things I noticed specifically with career driven women is that we are like pit bulls. We don't know when to let go. We don't know when to stop. So if we have not learned what healthy relationships are supposed to look like, we keep trying because subconsciously we feel like if we don't figure it out, then we are not successful. And then we feel like a failure. It's actually really interesting because something that makes us really good in our careers is actually something that is not so good when it comes to relationships. We see potential, we see the possibility, and we're very good at getting that out of people. That's one thing when somebody wants us to do it. When you're looking at a partner, we don't want to look at potential. We want to look at where they are already, see if they already have that skill set of being the potential partner that we are looking for, and then we go and decide from there if we want a relationship with that person. Most of us have been so good at doing the things, at getting the degrees and moving forward in our careers, all of that stuff, that we haven't taken a step back to know who we really are, what we really want for ourselves. So we don't really know what we need in a partner. If we don't know ourselves, how can we know what we need in a partner? And on top of that, a lot of us have been told that we are too much. So we kind of lower our standards because of that. But the reality is that we will always be too much for the wrong person. So instead of lowering our standards and trying to fit in somebody else's box, it's much more important to heal the parts of us that feel like we need to people please and take care of everybody else. And instead, take all that beautiful energy to work on ourselves, get the right skill set that we need so that we can start attracting healthier people and therefore actually building our own community of people that truly understand us instead of trying to force ourselves to be liked by people that don't even really get us. If anything I just said resonates for you, make sure you follow this account and grab your resources in my bio.